It's a doozy. That word was coined in the 1920s when the Duesenberg automobile was considered one of the most luxurious cars in the world. That doozy of a car was probably manufactured through 1937 right in Auburn, Indiana. Fast forward to today, when the roar of the engine is the sound of the Fort Wayne General Motors assembly plant in full swing, where more than 4,400 people build the Chevy Silverado and the GMC Sierra. Every day these workers assemble, paint, and prep full-size pickups, working in 2.85 million square feet of space. Yep, 2.85 million square feet of space. And in that space is 40 miles of conveyors, state-of-the-art robotics, and the most high-tech assembly equipment available. Before new cars and trucks can make it to the assembly line, designers and engineers must craft them. They start with an idea, or two, or three, or ten ideas and end up with another doozy. When new vehicles leave an assembly line, other workers step forward, like sales consultants, title clerks, and managers of businesses like Old Daniel Automotive Group. And remember, as our vehicles get older, we need expert mechanics to work in places like Tom Kelly Automotive, Old Daniel Automotive, and the local repair shop down the street. How about a job as a quality technician, talking to other business CEOs about the company vehicle they may need? Or you could be a manufacturing engineer, sales manager, or marketing specialist. There are tons of people whose jobs keep us driving, and you can be one of them, working in J.A. BizTown's GM manufacturing business. Yes, it takes a lot of people to create, manufacture, and keep our more than 1 billion cars and trucks on the roads around the world today. And when you're earning your own paycheck, one of them could be yours.